Hello, fellow engineers. This is Besiege by Spiderling. A uh, very popular game. Been out ages. Uh, everyone's been asking me to play it, like, for a long time. Haven't ever played this myself. Um, what is this? I just realized I can move the map. There's, like, floaty stuff. Level ends. Ah, oh, sandboxes. I think they're different levels. Oh, I can't wang it. I was hoping to wee it. Hang on, so where do we start? That one. Apparently, it's quite similar to, um... Wait, what was it similar to? Becastled? Yeah, I think Becastled, but the opposite. Or the person attacking. I think you get to build stuff. And this video is sponsored by the amazing web browser that is Opera GX. Now in the last video they sponsored, I went through the awesome features like the CPU and RAM limiters, the customization, ooh purple haze, and the Twitch and Discord integration. So I'm going to show you a couple of the other features that GX has. So there's loads of extensions for Opera, and I particularly like how many social ones there are. So there's Facebook Messenger, WhatsApp, and also an Instagram notifier, meaning you can keep all of your social media at hand straight in your browser. There's also loads of wallpapers, including animated ones. When you open a new tab, yes, we've got our background. <laughs> so maybe you're thinking you're missing your Google Chrome extensions. Well, yes, you can install Google Chrome extensions straight into Opera. And if you want to install all of your Google Chrome settings that you currently have, simple. Just go to browser settings, scroll down to synchronization. Click this, import bookmarks and settings. So if you were a Chrome user or one of the other browsers, you can choose everything you want to copy over just by clicking import. So if you're interested in trying out this awesome internet browser, click on the link in my description and let me know in the comments what your favorite feature is. Thanks very much for sponsoring this video and let's get back to it. Zone one, the Southern Cottage. Oh, it is a little cottage. Look at that. Destroy. I've got to destroy. Why is that called a skin? <laughs> <laughs> Looks like a block of wood to me. Oh god, what's this? Okay, I assume I've got to copy what they're telling me to build. So, whoa, it's like Lego. Boosh, boosh. Have I done it? Oh no, there's always more, there's always more. Uh, so wheels, bung a couple of wheels on so it can drive forward. Nice. Uh, place your machine on the ground with... What the hell is that? Do I have a... There's no button on the keyboard that looks like that, is there? <laughs> oh, or is it just a V? It might just be a V. No, it's not a V. Uh... <laughs> Why am I, why can't I do this? In the top toolbar, this one. Oh, there, there it is. There it is. So, boosh. Oh, that went pretty quick. Uh, and press that one. That's gonna destroy the village, is it? No. Oh, do I have to steer it? Is it W? No, that's me. <laughs> What's this all about? Oh, accelerate using up and down. Oh, God. Read the whole thing, Matt. Wee! Oh, look at the man running. Oh, I killed the sheep. Oh, <laughs> did you see that sheep? That was, that was nasty. So now what, just destroy that. Can I like make this a bit better? It's a bit, it's a bit lame, isn't it? Just do a stream of some CAD. I want to keep my viewers. I don't want to, <laughs> don't want to lose them all. Uh, what do we have down here? Do you have some like cool stuff? Weaponry, that's what I'm talking about. Oh my God, look at this. What is all this stuff? Oh, where do I even start? And okay, what are we destroying? We've got some chickens. How, do, what's the easiest way to destroy chickens? <laughs> All right, we'll start with the water cannon. Press Y to shoot. So, yeah, let's go full water. Do I need, like, a tank or anything? Or will that just auto-shoot? Yes, CAD stream. You want a CAD stream, really? <laughs> I can't think of anything worse. Right, so... Y. Oh, oh. Then Y to turn it off. Cool. All right, let's drive forward a bit. Oh, it's a bit front heavy. Oh, I can't steer. I just realized I can't steer. Can I nail that chicken? <laughs> Ready? Boosh! Oh, love it. Uh, right. Die, windmill. Okay, that's not that's not doing a lot, is it? Oh, no, I can't steer. This is crap. This is useless. All right, back to the drawing board. I need to add steering. What's your go-to CAD software? We use also CAD, mainly. It depends what we're doing. All right, so steering. Where's that? In locomotion, I guess? Or mechanical? Ah, oh, steering hinge. There you go. So I assume... How do I delete stuff? Oh, God. The game hasn't told me how to delete stuff. Destroy machine. Erase blocks. You can also press X. Okay. Steering or steering hint? Oh, God. What's the difference? I don't know what the difference is. We'll do steering hinge for now. So, wang that on there. That on there. All right. Let's see. Have I done that right? Oh, God. I keep using WASDA. I've got a... Oh, yes. It does work. All right. Come here, chickens. Oh, my God. It's not very good at steering. What's this all about? Ready? Boosh. <laughs> Oh dear. I think I just flung a chicken into another chicken. That was brilliant. Oh god, this is really bad at turning. <laughs> Should it be this hard to steer? I think maybe I want like my rear wheels to be loose, like free wheels. Right, I'm just gonna... I might actually spin this around. Easier said than done. Yeah, there you go. And then I might use the water cannons just to propel me into that. Just turn, man! 
Right, I think that's good. Right, what scanner's on? Extra power. We're going to miss it. <laughs> we got it. We got it. A lot to learn in this game, I think. Uh, next zone. Make an engineering video about the most structurally sound dick bridge you can design. That's like every other poly bridge video, I think. <laughs> Uh, right, I'm going to get rid of the water cannons, as fun as they were. I'm going to make the rear wheels free wheelers. Let me just see if that drives a bit better. Friggin' Wazda! <laughs> Who came up with these controls? Okay, that does turn a bit better now. Oh, look, there's a... Ah, the sheep's attacking me! Are they attacking me? Go off. <laughs> Go away! <laughs> I'm scared. Right, sod this. Boosh! Boosh! <laughs> am I meant to kill the sheep? What am, what am I actually destroying? What's the purpose of this level? I think it might be kill the sheep. Uh, and also, are they are they mines? I'm going to see if they're mines. Ready? Whoa, yep, yeah, they're mines. That was a very cool explosion. Right, okay. I can steer a bit better. I think I need to kill the sheep. Oh no, I just need to reach. Ah, oh, reach insignia. Okay, so I've got a couple of choices. I can either cane it and hope for the best. Or I can, I can shoot the mines out of the way. Or maybe I could sacrifice something. I'm going to try shooting. Just because I want to try out some of these weapons. So we've, we've got cannons. Only one shot. What does that mean? A shrapnel cannon. Oh, so the water cannon's unlimited. But these are all just one shot, are they? Is there like ammo or something? I don't know. Let's let's just see what happens. A wang a can. I'll just try that for now. So what is it? Why? No, it's not why. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry if you've played this game before. This must be very frustrating. That was underwhelming. The cannon was just like... <laughs> I mean, alternatively, I... Now I can steer. I can probably just... Oh no, they're all coming towards me. Sorry, sheep. I can just do that. There you go. Easy. Oh, good. Look, look at this. There's like archers. Oh, have I closed the tutorial or something? No, I don't think so. I think it's just it wants me to do what I want to do. So, okay. Uh, I reckon if I shoot that mine, that's probably the key. So, let's try shrapnel cannon. I just want to see what it does. All right, ready. Okay. Oh, wow. The arrows actually do a shitload of damage. Whoa. Okay, well, we know that cannon is rather useless for this job. But the old, the underwhelming one might actually be quite good. I'm sort of lined up, so let's just try that. Boosh. Whoa! <laughs> nice. And then I assume i got to steer through the blocks, and that's not going to go very well. So I might just go round. Or have I got to destroy the hut? I've got to destroy the hut. That's no good. Oh, crap. <laughs> I might build something just stupid and massive. See how many levels I can do with it. Boosh. Oh, I've got to destroy all the buildings. I see. I see. I've only got one cannon, which is a bit stupid. I probably should have added some more. Eh. <laughs> okay, all right. Start again. Right. Let's let's go mental. Let's, do we have, like, big wheels or anything? Large powered wheel. How big is that? Oh, it's not that much bigger. Let's just start from the beginning. Right, so it looks like we've got to start with this block in the middle, at least. Let's have a little look at... Flight! I want to build... Oh, I want to build so much stuff. So can I put this back in the air? What was it? That one? No, you're not. Oh, god damn. How do I anti that button? Ah, oh, got it. Got it. Right. What's in automation? Ooh, sensors, timers. Oh, look, we got all this armor and stuff. All right, let's build a frame to make a vehicle out of. I don't know how wide I want to go. I don't think I want to go too wide. I wonder if, can I build like tank trucks? Is that a thing? Because that would be, I don't know, would I be able to steer with that? I might be able to. I don't need like right wheel and left wheel. Dongmobile. All right, all right. It's going to happen. So I feel like that's our basic shape. Oh no, I think wooden logs will work better. Oh yeah, log would be way better. Yeah, it might have to be a reversed. I don't know actually. I'm re <laughs> I wasn't prepared for this. Dogging straight away. I uh, don't know what copy is. I'll just build how I do know. Oh god, why is it vertical? Hmm, not the most intuitive building thing. Oh, they only attach. Oh, okay, I get, I get it, I get it. I understand now. So in order to go up there, I need like a connecty, a brace? Nah. Oh my god, there's so many pieces. It's overwhelming. You've got smelly feet. That's not very nice. Right, build the spine of the dong first. So what does my dong look like? <laughs> it's got large powered wheels on the side. Yes. I don't know. I feel like I want tiny wheels, but these are like massive. Maybe if I, if I go underneath. Oh, they're quite long, the old wooden poles. That's not very dongish, is it? It's not really not working too well. I'll try and build my dong around this. This is just the spine. So let's have a look in armor. There might be some like plates and stuff, wooden panels. Can I get these to go like weird shapes? There's not really any curved. I was hoping for like a curved edge. Uh, advanced building. Curved edges. Yeah, I want that. I want advanced. How do I get to advanced? There's a little protractor somewhere. Is there a protractor anywhere? 
Or do I need to unlock it, maybe? Maybe you need to, like, beat the game. Okay, I think... Yes. Okay, so that's what I want. So if I undo that, so then I can build a bit more of a frame now and then use that to wrap it, I think. So I think I just want some small wooden blocks poking about everywhere. Okay, so let's try this wrap thing. It was in armor. Driving the dongmobile to pound town. <laughs> All right, so if I go from there to there. Bollocks. How do I ask a question? You just asked a question. So I can go to that, but not that. Is it because it's the same level? What if I make what if I make this one taller? It's not really how a dong works, but. Hmm. Confused. Too long. You reckon it's too long, All right? Let's try a block in the middle. So from there. Ah yes, I think you're right. I think you were right. Okay, I'm gonna have to go a lot bigger. A lot bigger. Do wheels work through that's what I want to try next. Do that. Does that cock up like? Let's just see if that drives. Oh, yeah. Yeah, it broke straight away. Ah, I'm getting arrowed as well. Uh, fuck off, mate. <laughs> what are they doing? I'm going to have to go a lot bigger than I was expecting to. And I'm going to have to avoid the wheels, which is quite difficult. There's not a massive amount of space in this box thing. So a log there. And I'll just do this in single blocks just to sort of get it started. I think I actually want to go up one and then out. Up there. Oh, crap. I built that on the wrong side. So hopefully I can make that a bit of a circle. Mate, I'm not sure how to get the middle point is the only thing. I don't really think I can. It's going to be like, yeah, it's not going to be much of a circle, but whatever. It is like a carnival float. <laughs> oh, that was completely wrong. I was not paying attention there. It needs to go up another one. Okay, out there. So I, it's not going to be very curved. It's going to be quite a rectangular thing. But what I want to do is sort of make the tip dangerous. So whether we want a drill out the front. I'm surprised this drill thing doesn't work because it works there, but not. Is it because oh, the level's too long? We can we can translate though. We can move it back a bit. There we go. All right, so we've got that in the middle. Hang on. It's too early for that. It's too early for that. We need, where is it? We need normal blocks to about there. And then can we get a drill on? Yes. And then we can start doing this, I hope. Oh, we're not going to get around the wheels though. That's the only downside. All uh, right, so armor. So I want to go there, 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 there. What the shit? <laughs> Undo that last one. There you go. Oh, no, yeah, I, f I forgot some. I forgot some. Douche. Right, now we might be able to wrap it. So I can do... Can I do from there to there? Yes, that could work. It might actually look a bit more like a steam train than I wanted it to. But uh, we're only getting started. We're only getting started. I'm a noob. Wrap it before you tap it. <laughs> exactly. Exactly. I wish I could have like a floating node, but I can't. So I'm just going to do that. Nice. This could actually be quite decent. My bar is extremely low. But uh, right. So from there to there. And then I'll see if I can like do underneath without ruining the wheels to there and there. Yes, that clears the wheel. Sweet. Okay. It looks a bit bashed about. Yeah, it's 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 seen some uh seen some things. Let's put it that way. Right. So the question is, how do I curve the front? Do I I don't want to make it too pointy. I'd like a bit of a ten weapons too cruel for war. <laughs> I don't know whether I don't I don't know how to make it curved. I can't do a sphere, can I? Or like a half sphere. Can you solve a Rubik's cube? I can using engineering. I can take the stickers off and put them. <laughs> so let's try. Doing like a triangular. <laughs> what have I made? Where is it? There it is. There it is. And then the final one. <sighs> oh, that's a good question. What's your favorite slang term for knob? Um, it probably would just be something simple like knob. Gentleman sausage is a good one. Uh, how do I how do I move this again? Transform. There it is. Let's get the tip as close as we can. Oh, can I go out now? No, I have no room at the back. <laughs> face reveal? Why do you want a face reveal? Yeah, just Google Brad Pitt. Like, it's close enough. Uh, we're gonna we're gonna tip back quite a bit though. I don't know how to get these wheels like in line, so we will be pointing upwards. Uh, I need to do nuts though. How the hell do I do nuts? I actually laughed at that Brad Pitt joke. What do you mean joke? How do I add nuts though? Because I've got no room back there. Why is there such a small space limit? Where are the balls at? Yeah, I know. I'm trying. I am trying, sir. What is the goal of this game? <laughs> to complete the levels while building a schlong. <laughs> actually, yeah, actually, whoever asked earlier, someone asked, what's my favorite slang for a schlong? 
It's schlong. Definitely schlong. Unfortunately, this isn't going to complete the level. I'm pretty sure about that. Because I got those pesky archers. But what I could do is make nut like out here somewhere. What if I like do that? And then just have my nuts here. My nuts could just be like... Is this weird? Is this weird? <laughs> my nuts could just be like a load of cannons or something. Oh, I, there's circular saws! Oh my god. I want circular saws somewhere. Right, no, no. I gotta I got complete the knob. Come on, Matt. This is the only reason people are watching. So I don't know how to like layer up cannons. That's my only downside to this design. So I don't think you can stick them at the back. Let me do that. Let me just see. Replace front wheels with sword. Can I? Will that work? <laughs> right, I gotta try that quick. I gotta see if that actually works. Can you imagine? Oh, it doesn't work. Oh, that one does. <gasps> it should work. I think it's that. It's that panel. Let's delete that panel. Yes. <laughs> oh, right. Okay, we gotta we gotta rebuild that panel quick. Has uh, has anyone watched? Do any of you guys watch uh, Reed Captain? So uh, he like proper built some cool stuff in this game. But I bet he never used circular saws for wheels, eh? <laughs> yeah, if you haven't checked out Recaps, go check his channel out. He uh, does some cool stuff. Builds, like, actual engines and big brain stuff. But I'm going to leave that episode here, guys. If you want to see how far the schlong gets in Besiege, uh, give the video a like and let me know in the comments. And if it does well enough, I'll make that into a video. But yeah, peace, love, and a half-built schlong. And I'll catch you guys next time. Bye.